this is Victoria from James Anthony Salon and today I'm going to show you a really great trick to get in a nice movement and curvature of a round brush blow dry without having to blow dry your hair. So this technique is really great if you don't have time to spend blow drying your hair or if you want to add a little bit of extra movement and curve to your crown area. So how we're going to achieve this is you need two things. You need a round brush and you need a smoothing iron. And the trick to this is we're going to smooth the hair and then twirl it on the round brush while it's still warm to get that nice movement. So we're going to clip our hair back and take a section of hair after your hair is already dry. And your section just needs to be half the size of your round brush. So you can use any round brush you want. Just make sure it's your section is half the size of it. And what we're going to do is we're just going to pull this piece of hair out. We're going to go down with our smoothing iron just like we were smoothing our hair, but instead of letting it fall flat, we're going to twirl it on our round brush. So let's try that. We're going to take our hair, just go down the hair with the smoothing iron like we would normally, and then instead of letting it fall flat, we're just going to pick it up with our round brush and kind of give it a little bit of a twirl here. let it fall. So let's try that one more time. We're going to take a section half the size of our round brush, grab that hair, just go down with our smoothing iron, and then pick it up with our round brush and just kind of twirl it like you would if you were round brushing your hair. Let it cool for a second. And there you go. So as you can see, once we're finished, this looks like we spent a lot of time doing a gorgeous round brush and this took no time at all. So we're just going to go ahead and finish off by using a little bit of our Hold Me Tight Finishing Spray. And you are perfect and ready for any occasion. 